Hello, I would like to show you how to get CI Engineer for free, a trial version. For this, you have to go to CIA's website, which is uh, CIA.net, and there we will request a trial version, or in case you're a student, you can request a student version, and then I will show you the steps on how to install C Engineer with all the required modules. If we go to CIA.net, according to your language, the website will detect uh, and adapt. To download a free trial, we need to access this free trial. And here, in case you are a professional, as they say, meaning that you are an engineer, you will have to select the product, which will be CI Engineer, and then fill out this form with your organization details, and then click Submit. Once you click Submit, the, the query will be sent to SIA and they will uh, analyze it and send some installing instructions and a trial version. In case you're a student, you see here a student can request a free academic software license. So students can access this part and here mainly is the same workflow, only different fields to complete. And you can apply if you're a student or a teacher, and you have to agree with the terms and conditions. Uh, if in case you don't have an institutional email uh, provided by your university, SIA will request a copy of your student's ID card. So it's quite a simple step. You'll get the instructions. You have to scan or take a photo of your a student ID and mail it back to SIA once a SIA employee analyzes the photo, the snapshot you send, uh, you are authorized and you will receive an email with the installation kit and the license. In case you do the request by weekend or are in a rush to install SIA faster, you can go to support, downloads, and here you will find the latest SIA versions. I recommend working with the latest version because uh, it's always the best and um, has the most features and it's the enhanced version. And always pick up the latest version in order to avoid waiting for further updates. You always have some uh, novelties presented, some release notes, and there are two options. One option is to download the entire installation kit, which can take up to 2 gigabytes, or a web setup, which is 1 megabyte, but it will install download while downloading. So it will be highly dependent on the internet. And if you are going to install somewhere else where you don't have internet access, I strongly recommend the full download link. If you go here, you will uh, be prompted. I will cancel it as I already downloaded it. You have here the release with the version, you can go to the downloaded folder and then extract here, go to this folder and run the setup. Here you can choose the language in which you're interested in installing the software. You will need the latest Microsoft.NET framework in order to run it. A restart might be necessary in case you didn't have the .NET. And then we click Next. We can complete the, our details and if you wish or not, you can uh, subscribe to this improving SIA. You choose the installation path and then you go here to Custom. And here we have these add-ons which are really useful. So I suggest selecting this feature and all sub features. And for languages, you can choose the language you need. And then here is the licensing part where we'll, you will definitely need to receive the email from SIA. And uh, there you'll have some uh, 
activation files and instructions. Viewer will have no license. Trial version will be a 30-day trial. Student version will have uh, the entire functionality of CI Engineer with some watermarks and some export limitations, but uh, when it stands for calculations and report, we have the full uh, force of CIA. Limited to a year, then you can uh, up, uh, update your license for free for another year if you're still a student. Standalone means that you have a hard lock that is attached to your uh, PC. Only floating means you will connect to a server and then there are some extra options in case you don't have the hard lock to connect to a server or the other way around. If the server doesn't work, use your hard lock. Then next, here we can uh, choose the code. In my movies you'll see I'm designing according to Eurocode, however there are also some other codes. And then you can choose the metric system or the imperial system. And here are some settings regarding the autosaves, which may take some space. So you have the options to limit the time for autosaves or the number of backup files it automatically creates. Then we hit click next and we can also install concrete section 16.1. And we can copy in case you use CR16, you can copy this user settings and then we go to install. We won't configure the Tecla plugin right now, but we need to say no or yes in order to let the wizard continue its installing of the new files. And that's about it. We can click finish. Uh, restart is advised and we'll also click yes. And finally, if already everything is set all right, you just have to double click this new icon, C engineer. 16.1 and you'll be ready to go with your first new project.